We're following developing news this morning as a major shift will soon be coming to Virginia's General Assembly. A prominent Republican lawmaker from the peninsula is retiring after decades on the job. Senator Tommy Norman currently serves as the Senate Minority Leader. But what exactly does this all mean now for the balance of power moving forward? Our Camaria Bray joins us now to explain those details. Camaria, good morning. Good morning, Katie and Asia. Well, Tim on your side asked him about his retirement and he said, quote, it's time. Now, Norman represents District 3 that covers parts of Hampton, Suffolk, Isle of Wight, and James City County. His leadership at the Capitol allowed him to hold the title of Senate Minority Leader. And recently, the senator created a bill that would allow police chiefs to make curfews during civil unrest situations. The bill was passed in the Senate and House, and it's awaiting the governor's signature for it to go into law. He also created a bill that would require school principals to report sexual assault to police that became a law back last year and back in 2018 Norman got the Tommy tax approved which created a 1% state sales and use tax in the historic triangle now Norman's term as senator ends January of next year and news of his retirement comes after Senate Majority Leader Dick Saslaw of Fairfax announced he won't be running for re-election either that means no matter what happens in, in November there there will be a new leadership in Virginia's upper chamber next year. Both senators have served majority and minority leaders since 2008. I'm Kamaria Bray, to know your side.